There are so many varieties of milk available in the market today. Which milk is the best? Is it the whole raw milk or homogenized milk or 2% or fat free? With so many options, which one is the most nutritional and healthy for our consumption? Now looking into the available milk, homogenized milk. In this case, the milk fat is broken up into tiny globules which ensures uniform distribution of fat throughout the milk. This process modifies the composition of pasteurized milk. The lactose sugar in milk undergoes modification. This could put extra burden on the pancreas especially in diabetics. The 2% fat or the fat free milk, the fats are separated from the milk. The fat soluble vitamins like vitamin A, vitamin D, E and vitamin K are also removed which in turn disturbs its natural synergy. The whole raw milk which is boiled contains the full complements of fats. These complements of fats aids in easy absorption of the fat soluble vitamins and calcium. This clearly points to the benefit of using whole raw milk. Now let's move on to the pasteurization techniques. HTST pasteurization which is high temperature short time pasteurization used as a standard across the industry. In this process milk is heated from 72 to 76 degree centigrade for 15 seconds followed by cooling. This process does kill the bacteria but does not completely break down the proteins to simpler amino acids making it harder for us to digest. Now the whole raw milk. Buy this raw milk and then boil this milk at the temperature around 100 degree centigrade instead of 76 degree centigrade which makes it safe for the consumption by killing harmful bacteria. During boiling, the fat content in milk rises to the top, which is then skimmed off. Also, boiling at this temperature until it can be skimmed off helps in breaking down the proteins into simpler amino acids, which can be easily absorbed by our body. To conclude this, buying raw whole milk and boiling it is a best option. For more details, please visit our website at foodandremedy.com. Thank you.